All new attend the emergency medical services program at Portland Community College is facing a new kind of reality, a virtual one. Yeah, their new medical simulation center opened up this past school year to students, and now they've added virtually re virtual reality training as well. Fox 12's Chandler Watkins joins us live in studio with much more on this. That's right. In the 2200 square foot facility, they're able to recreate the back of an ambulance, a hospital room and more to allow students to have the hands on training for situations that they may experience in real life. The clinical coordinator of the program says this type of training is extremely valuable. All healthcare disciplines benefit uh, uh, immeasurably from from simulation. Shocking. At Portland Community College's Cascade Campus Medical Simulation Center, the EMS program is using some of the latest developments in healthcare simulation to assess student readiness before they treat real patients. Simulations can start with the 911 call to dispatch. We use radios to dispatch students um, to the first environment that is a simulated residence. At that point, the student can treat the patient in the residence. We can move the, the simulated patient or the mannequin into the back of the ambulance, and from there we can move into the emergency room. The center also has virtual reality technology, which can be used by students at home or in the VR suite at the center. They'll work in a team in a hybrid simulation where the team leader on the ambulance is in the virtual space interacting with the avatar and the team member has a mannequin and they will physically do the tasks that the team leader delegates. So we learn not only team leadership in virtual space, but team membership in the real space as well. Cameras and microphones can record the scenarios, which can then be used for playback and review for students. The clinical coordinator calls the training invaluable and thanks those who voted for a 2017 bond to fund the center. It is only because of the voters of Multnomah County that were wise enough to set this money aside for healthcare simulation that we're able to build something like this for the people who are gonna provide healthcare to those voters. 100. Okay. Thank you, pulse Listen, check. Pulse check, we yeah. have a pulse. That coordinator says he would like to see the simulation center utilized by other PCC programs like the criminal justice or vet tech programs, as well as for practice for local ambulance services, among other things. In studio, Chandler Watkins, Fox 12, Oregon.